Post game with Tony Hand. Tony, congratulations on your thousand leave game. Unfortunately, couldn't quite finish as good as the 999th. Uh, yeah, I thought we I thought we played really well tonight against Nottingham, but I think obviously once again fell short by that odd goal. Uh, but yeah, you got to give, got to give the guys credit; they worked hard, and uh, it's a bit frustrating because I think the goals were a bit. Uh, it's hard to explain it. Can you know, be just a, a bad bounce here or there with the puck, and next you know they've got a, guys got a breakaway. But uh, kind of guys played well. I've kind of. And Stevie Fone who came in from a backup from Coventry done really well for us this weekend, so uh, it's really appreciated. So I'm just, I'm just, uh, it'd be nice. I've got the the at least a point tonight, but uh, again, we got two points over the weekend, so we just have to keep marching on. So with Scott Van Cows are still injured, how are we going to look at progressing that over the next couple of weeks? Uh, I, I, to be honest, yeah, it's, it's, I'll have to wait and see how Scotty progresses through injury. I haven't even, I take it one weekend at a time because we don't know how long it's going to be. If it's going to be a week, two weeks, so we've got to uh, again monitor the situation. So. Uh, we'll look it up in the next couple of days. Despite tonight's result, the team seems to have played a good level this weekend. No, the, guys, the guys played really well. Uh, I can I give them credit? We, can, we had an, enough chances to win it. Uh, and we're up against a good team in Nottingham. It's not like we're up, at a, again, we're up at bad teams. We're up at teams who are above us in the standards this week. Uh, and we're more than a match for these teams. But you need that odd bit of luck and uh, sometimes you don't get it. And I don't think tonight, a couple of times we never got it. So that's just, you just got to suck it up sometimes. So what are your hopes for the rest of the season? We're hoping to overhaul Cardiff in that sixth spot? Uh, I'd like to do that. And I'd also, obviously, to get to the finals weekend, that's our objective right now. Uh, to be honest, it's if, where we finish, if we finish above Cardiff or not, but my objective is to get to the, the last four. Hard-fought match, but just come out on the wrong end of the scoreline. How does dressing room feel after that? Uh, I mean, as good as you can feel after a loss. I mean, I think we played well enough to win. We had our chances, and... Uh, you know, they got pretty one controversial one there with a glove pass in front, and then the last one they scored was an awful goal too. So, uh, you know, Steve Foam played he, he played well again. So, uh, you, you, you know, there's not much you can say after a loss. You just kind of gotta gotta take it and get out of here. So, what exactly was our game plan for tonight? Same as always, try to get a good start and uh, play as hard as we always do. And, uh, I think tonight was a, sl- a little bit of a sloppy game. You could tell with the ice. The ice was terrible. Um, it's just real warm, and uh, there's pucks bouncing everywhere. I mean, it's not. I'm sure it wasn't that great to watch. Cause it wasn't. Uh, there's just pucks going everywhere. So, uh, you know, that's just the way it goes sometimes. You made a bit of an error for the second goal. Might sound like a bit of a stupid question, but how exactly does that feel? What's that? For the second goal, where they sent the puck in front of the net and they scored with just nine seconds left, how did that feel as a player? Uh, well, you want to jump off a bridge uh, when that thing, you know, you get the puck on your stick, you look over to your partner, you try to make a pass and it bounces over your stick uh, right to a guy for a breakaway for a goal. Uh, as a D-man, there's nothing worse you can do for yourself than, uh, you know, pretty disgusted, obviously, with that whole play and that's just the way it goes sometimes. And, uh, you know, you just try to go out and... I don't know. After, after you do something like that, you have to either uh, go hit somebody or uh, score a goal or do something. And we came out right away in the third, and Passy scored a goal right away, so it negated that. And uh, you know, after that, you feel a little bit better that that's not the game-winning goal. And um, you know, we played pretty well in the third. We out- outplayed them and outscored them, and uh, you know, we just ended up on the short end of the stick. Scott Bassett, thank you very much. Thanks.